Recently I heard the Lord say, Do not despise the stretching, it is making way for my fire and the flood of my spirit. Those words, fire and flood, were going over and over in my spirit as the Lord spoke. The Lord is bringing a deep stretching in hearts and lives right now to make room for his fire and his flood the tidal wave of outpouring. The Lord showed me that many are feeling very uncomfortable in the stretching, but this stretching is a good thing. It's an extension for more. The Lord is making room like never before and he is looking for those who are tender to the yielding. He is looking for those who will lean in and not lean away. There is a deep wing and a deep consecration the Spirit of God is calling his people into, it's a deeper yielding and heralding call unto him, unto his heart and unto his ways. Those who yield, those who make room, those who go with the leading, direction, guidance and strategy of the Holy Spirit will be positioned for this glorious outpouring of fire and flood of his Spirit that the Lord is releasing. I saw many have felt almost drowned by the waters of trial and opposition in this hour that have come relentlessly like wave after wave, but the Lord showed me that in the making room, in the yielding, in the positioning there is a mighty tidal wave of his Spirit, the greatest outpouring they have seen that is going to plunge them into the depth of his heart, his wisdom, his power and his revelation than ever before. I saw in these moments what would have taken twelve months to do in the natural, will be done in twelve hours. There is a greater fullness God is wanting to bring. There is a greater training, equipping and impartation the Lord is releasing that is needed for the days ahead. I did not feel this as a light call from the Lord, I felt the weight and almost urgency upon this invitation of the Lord to make room and be positioned. It's a glorious outpouring, a mighty overflow of His Spirit and a release of His fire that is going to shift and change everything. Do not despise the stretching, embrace it, yield to it, for it is making way for His fire and His flood. Don't try to control it or manipulate it, the stretching is needed to make room. His fire and His flood, it's personal and corporate outpouring, but he holds the reins. The positioned cry is, Have your way.